The SoFi credit card can't quite say it's the best, but definitely can't say it's the worst. I wouldn't say this card is for everyone. It's more so for those people that's focused on cash back and not really worried about all those categories and figuring out what card they want to use here because it's a 2% flat cash back credit card and some people just like it straightforward like that and you know we all love cars with no annual fees and the sofa credit card offers just that it has no annual fees flat two percent cash back what more do you want out of a credit card well i guess you could ask for three percent wait actually you do get 3% cash back the first 12 months if you have direct deposit to your SoFi bank account, which of course that does mean you do have to have a bank account with SoFi. And if you do decide that you wanna do that, you can use my link below. It helps the channel out and we greatly appreciate it. As far as getting approved for the SoFi credit card, I would recommend you have a credit score around 670, preferably 700 for higher odds of approval, but it does vary, it does, depend on the factors of your credit score, such as your payment history, credit utilization, and just stuff of that nature. So you wanna double check that, make sure your credit score is in place and you're doing everything right by that before you go to attempt to get the SoFi credit card. On the bright side, when you apply for the SoFi credit card, they perform a soft pool, which does not affect your credit score. If you decide to take the line of credit on the credit card that you just got approved for, that's when they will actually perform the hard pool, which will affect your credit score. So just be careful with that. And if you're one of those people that like to travel, SoFi has you covered. You now have the option to get unlimited 3% cash back when you use your SoFi credit card to book through SoFi Travel powered by Expedia. And that's cool because SoFi also offers no foreign transaction fees. So when you use SoFi Travel, you don't have to worry about those annoying fees. And the SoFi credit card offers so much more. I throw it up on the screen right here, like this one right here, a thousand dollar complimentary cell phone insurance coverage. And it's a lot more stuff like this, or maybe like this. So if you do decide to get the SoFi credit card, make sure you use my link below to get an extra $50 if you are approved. Also, another thing you wanna keep in mind with the SoFi credit card is the credit limit that you received is the credit limit you're gonna to have to stick with for now. Cause right now, SoFi doesn't offer a credit limit increase. Like I said in the beginning, this card might not be right for everyone, but if you like 2% cash back flat, you know, no complications, not really difficult to understand. Uh, possibility for a high credit limit, great customer service, then this car might be right for you. But if you're like an OG in the credit card game and you have a car for every category, then this might not be the right thing for you. And of course, I hate that I have to say this, but with any credit card that you apply for, if you do get approved, be very responsible with it, pay your balances off in full, use it right, use it how it's intended to be used, not to fund your life or to help you get out of hard times. And of course, I do understand people have those moments, but try to be responsible as possible and try to put yourself in the best position and don't hurt the future you. Good luck to you and I really hope you do get it because it is a good car and it can help your credit card portfolio if you're into that stuff. But I'll see you on the next one.